What's up guys, it's Ten Kosh, and today we are taking a look at the Sword of Xolan, the platformer game that kinda involves a lot of jumping and actual precise timings. You will love it, I like the gameplay, I like the style, I, I like the pacing, but yeah, you will see. Let's go into the game, guys. Let's go. Alright guys, there is the game, we go right, we go left, we jump and attack, nice, fireball. Oh, we can do the jump. Oh, that's a platformer. All right, that's not an RPG, so gotta be careful. Uh, double jump. Let's go. Nice, we got the money. Attack. Sweet. I like the style of this game, guys. I like the style. Look at that. That's princess. Save the the lady. Nice. Dangerous. Let's go. I I like like guys. This is good. Like, the game design is fantastic. Chest with the gold. Alright. We got two more princesses to save. Let's let's move. Alright, we can create the fireball now. Bam! Nice. It costs mana and mana doesn't regenerate, so... You know. Uh, oh, we took damage. Not bad. Oh, princess. Nice. Another one. It will save him. Alright, let's move. Alright, we managed to save two princesses. Nice. We didn't save the third one. But we're good. We can go to the next level. And I wonder what will happen. Next one. And we will be just at the next level and doing our daily things. Let's go and see what's new. So on this level we managed to save everyone. And let's see. Do we get extra reward for that? Everyone is saved. We got the chest. We got the coins. So uh, level 2 is completed. We got the money. But what do we do with that? Let's go to the main menu and see. Game cards, skill, improved, nice, good luck, let's go. Ooh, 1.5k, ooh, that's ex that's expensive, we're gonna grind more in order to get those, okay. So yeah guys, when you play this game, you gotta be really careful so you won't screw up and you won't get into the traps of the lo oh, like, like, like this, into the traps of the local uh, creatures, I think we can, we can jump up here, that's nice. And look at that, yeah, they're always trying to take us down, so we gotta be careful and save all the villagers. Those are not only the princesses, but the local villagers as well. And basically, that's the game. You, I just wanna see what do we get. Ah, secret area, nice. I think you don't want to be in this water, I'm not sure. Let's see. Ah, you're good, you're good, you're just slow. You're just slow. So I'm wondering, like, what you can do with that money. We will see. Those guys are the worst because, you know, you can't really get close to them easily. So you gotta be careful. Got all the rewards again. And, uh, well, yeah, let's play a little bit more. And I'll get back to you when we'll get enough money to buy the skill upgrade. Oh my god, it's getting harder and harder. Look look at the size of this. Like, oh! I used to do double jump. Oh, oh! Yeah, guys, this is getting harder and harder. And what yes. do I do now? Oh, the chest. Okay. Gotta be careful. I'm dead. RIP. <laughs> when you die, by the way, you start from the start of the level, so you gotta do everything from the scratch. So, yeah, be careful. Okay, now we got the flying islands as well, so gotta be careful even more. And I think later on we'll get the flying islands with the enemies shooting at us and all that stuff. Like, like, like this thing. Look, look at that. Look, what? Do oh my god. Stop it. Okay, gotta save that lady. This is the last villager. Is it a lady? No. Hey, it is a lady. Ah, that's not the last one, we got one more. Okay, we got enough money to buy the game card. Let's go and see what does it do. After this, we go back. Like, I don't care about saving princesses if we can get the new loot. So, let's get this one. Buy. Extra, extra mana. mana slot. That's actually pretty cool. So, those cards will make you stronger. Because they will give you extra HP, extra attack, extra something. In our case, we got mana. So, yeah. Uh, what else do we have? We have the achievements. Oh, yeah, we got the achievements. And I think that's it, like, the main problem that I have with this game, right now, is um, that you can't really move your uh, controls too much. Because when you go to the controls, like, you can move them, right, but you can't make them bigger. Like, I'd like those buttons to be bigger, because my finger is too big for those, and I miss sometimes, so that makes me sad. Otherwise, 
otherwise the game is pretty solid guys i can advise it to you let's go back to this to something that looks better yeah i can advise these guys for you because it seems like a good game it's a fun game and it's a really good balance between the difficulty and intensity i think later acts like the higher difficulty higher acts like we start here at adventure and then we got to act two act three those will be harder and there i would get like the emotional damage <laughs> yeah if we'll get emotional damage there then it's fair because you'll be further into the game but the first act is pretty straightforward and uh i wouldn't say casual but it's pretty easy so you can play through that no problem uh style is good music is good gameplay is good so i advise this game to you guys other than that don't forget to like this channel subscribe follow and uh, check the pin command in the video description for the link tree and there you can follow um, my other YouTube channels, like my other content, my other social media. So go there and follow me everywhere because it's a good thing to do. Other than that, guys, thank you very much for watching. That's about it for now. Stan Kosh out. Have a good one. Bye.